what it do. Merry Christmas. Um, Happy New Year. Uh, this year was a huge year for me personally. Like, this was pretty much the year where like I, Empire really started getting going. Um, I know I don't really have much of an audience still. Uh, mostly making it for myself. But regardless, um, a lot of my creative endeavors really start to open up this year, and I got I got a lot of things done. I had I did my first ever feature length film. It's barely it's like borderline feature feature with actual actors that is, um, which was a huge endeavor. It took nine months to film Florida Man, <clears throat> and that was an idea I had made up like two years beforehand. So I was really grateful that I was able to make that and that I had people that were willing to work with me. Thank you. I got a lot of my childhood um, home movies on like a, a hard drive and I actually was able to make them into watchable videos on YouTube and, and now that part of my life, that part of my career is like finally unlocked from obscurity. Of course, no one really gives a shit, I, I do realize that, but to, to me personally, um, I, I thought that was really, really important for anyone that was curious. The Sulfubi series started and ended this year, and that was one of the most satisfying experiences I've ever had making anything, really. It was, it started out as just, uh, my brother gave me a tip, like, you know, maybe use the things you collect for something productive. And I was like, okay, well, if I were to make like a, a review series, like like he's saying, I should make it cinematic. And I'm, I'm not gonna make a boring fucking normal review series. I'm gonna make it special. I'm gonna make it empirify. And I think it worked out. Um, I'm into the reviewing stuff, of course, but um, you know, filming actual movies, making an actual film, that's what Empire is all about. So I made sure that Soul Fubi was. A, like a like a really good stranglehold on on storytelling that I previously wasn't really able to do due to like uh, like time constraints. It was the first thing I had ever done that was like episodic, like it was a series. And after I finished it, I it was it, I I felt so satisfied, far more than I did Florida Man, ironically. And just like the the legacy of Godzilla series, the everything that has come out within this year, I I. Put my best foot forward, and I I made as much content, as many as many movies, films, and as many reviews as I possibly could this year, and I and I think it genuinely paid off. One of my films actually got a thousand views for the first time, which was the Gamera short, which I had made on a whim, pretty much. And I'm glad that the first video to ever get to a thousand views was actually a film that I worked hard on, and. I'm, I'm eternally grateful for that. The Jurassic Park dub videos kind of just got birthed out of like nothing. And uh, ironically, although I think they are the worst videos I've ever put out, I do think they're probably the most fun to make. Uh, I just, I have so much love for the series that like making my own stupid version of it, regardless of whether it's even funny, is just, is just so satisfying to me. Now, regardless of my uh, audience, which I, uh, you know, I don't really have one, uh, I, I'm very grateful that any of my videos get any sort of views in general. Even if it gets 30 views, it's like, well, you know, but people watched it. That means people actually took the time to click on my video. And that's, that's really huge for me because I never really had that when I was a kid. I just made my movies for myself and for no audience. Um, now I make my movies for myself, but you know a few people watch them here and there, which is cool. I, uh, I want to say thank you uh, to anyone who supported the channel and supported Studio Empire. Um, those who have come, those who have gone. Um, some I, I especially want to thank the <laughs> some of the actors that I've gotten in some of my movies, like Florida Man. Thank you so much for, to everyone who who took the time out of their day to support a film that I had confidence in, that I wanted to, a story that I wanted to tell. Thank you so much for that. 
Um, same thing with Soul Fubi. Everyone, everyone that's worked with me, I'm, I'm very grateful that they that they were around and that they they had the the will to to help me with this stuff. Now to get real with you, I'm gonna take off this hat. Now to get real with you guys, um, like when I started Studio Empire, I was in I want to say tenth grade, and I was I was in a really rough spot in my life. I was really depressed. I laugh about it now, but really it was it was bad. And back then I was just I was in a, a very emotionally inexperienced dude. I, I was I, I was just like I was kind of just like a little a little hermit crab. I just had a hard time with like everything. But Studio Empire making videos and movies um, really kind of brought me out. I'm very blessed and I'm, I'm glad that I was I have I had an outlet that made my life genuinely authentically better. It's made me it's made me truly solidify the fact that I you know I'm a filmmaker. I'm a storyteller and regardless of anything that is who I'll always be. Luckily through a lot of the mistakes I've made as a person um Studio Empire wasn't one of them, you know. I've matured a lot since that little goober in 10th grade who was pretty much desperate to find any sort of purpose. The the person I am on set is the person I want to be. That that those are the moments when I truly feel like myself and when I truly feel like regardless of whether I'm getting money from it um it may, it makes me feel like yes, this is this is what I do and I'm I'm fulfilled. So with everything done for 2022 I just want to wish you guys a, uh, a Merry Christmas, a Happy Holidays, and a Happy New Year. Let's hope that 2023 is good. <laughs> there's, there's a lot of big stuff coming in the future. Of course, as a huge expectation, I might not fall through. <laughs> it, might, then it might fall through, but my current uh, wish right now is that 2023 is going to be a productive and very developmental year for Studio Empire. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Even if it's like a little comment, any sort of interaction with the channel is so appreciated. Any any subscriber is so appreciated, you know? That's an entire being that decided that, you know, my video, my film was worth spending their own time watching. And that, I will, I will always, I, will, I hope to God I never take that for granted. With that being said, thank you so much. For, uh, for everything and there is an immense amount of stuff coming your way you have no idea this is just a fucking beginning just watch